Hey guys, it's Classy Craft Collector, and today we're going to be unboxing the Capsters Bottle Caps Kit. Today, this is it up closer, and it has a bunch of things that you can do to make some bottle cap monsters. So let's open it up and see what it comes with. But first, let's take a look at the back. So as you can see, it comes with a 38-page book of ideas, inspiration, and instructions, 15 bottle caps, over 160 punch-outs, and a custom klutz glaze, 6 charms, googly eyes and jewels, and clips, and clips, and coated wire. So let's open it up to see what it, to see what we can do. So here's the book on this side, and it has a lot of pages, and also it has a bunch of um, pages that you could put on the top of the bottle caps. So now let's open the bottle cap area. As you can see, it has some charms over here. Let me just open this. There's lots of tape, and it's very hard to do this, so... I apologize in advance for this video being long because I take a lot of time to open this. Ugh, there's tape over here too, but for now, there's. I just want to tell you that there's 168 of these punch outs that you can put inside of the bottle packs. Oh, there's more tape. They fill these things. So much. Got it. So it has 15 bottle caps that we can make, and it looks pretty fun to make. Ugh, why isn't it doing it? But just fast forward this video to when I'm actually doing this. Oh, got it. There's another piece of tape. Okay, there. So it comes with 15 bottle caps that are silver and they have um and they have klutz on the back. Maybe that's I think that's the brand of these. Yep, 100 percent klutz certified. So this is the bottle cap we'll be using right now. And then we need to open this part up, and it has a bunch of, um, what's it called? Punch-outs that you put inside of the bottle cap. It also has six charms you can put inside the bottle cap. Right now, I have the penguin. There's also a dog, a butterfly, an alien, and a cat, and an eyeball. So here is one page of the charms. There is a lot of pages inside because there's 168. And now I'm going to open up this charms pack. That was easier to open than the little pack thingy over there. But, sorry. Sometimes I have to do that. So... I guess we have 168 of them. Population over 168 punch outs. And there's a lot. So, um, first, I have to pick one to use right now. And I'm going to be using the. Hmm. I'll use. Here, I'm going to use the eye over here and put the eyeball on the eye. See this eye over here? It's cool. And then I'm going to put this eyeball on top of the eye. Like that. In my bottle cap, of course. So, for now, I'm going to put this aside, except for my glaze that they gave me this whole bottle of and some some a toothpick actually I won't use those right now but so I'm going to put this aside and show you how to make this bottle cap so there's a mouse on the other side but over here and I'm going to open my glaze and oh 
boom, it's already open. There's nothing that you need to put on top of it or cut out. So I'm just going to take some glaze and put it around so I can stick on this as glue on my eyeball. And then I'm also going to put this eyeball on. So I'm going to put some of this glaze on the back. There's a little hole in the eyebrow. Don't make sure. Don't waste your glue, your glaze, or whatever it is, and put it on the eyeball. So that's my eyeball. And I'm also going to glaze on top of it so it looks shiny. There. And then in a little bit, the glaze will dry and it will get very shiny. So that's the first one I made. Next, I'm going to make, I have another bottle cap. And this time, I'm not going to use a charm. I'm going to use some jewels. So it's a easy, easy packet of jewels. And for my thingy, I just want to use a plain circle. So there's a blue one. It looks kind of cool like thunder. That's what I'm going to use. So I'm going to glaze it onto my bottle cap. And then I'm going to sprinkle on some of these teensy weensy little jewels. Oh my god, that's a lot of paper around it. <sighs> so, how do you open this? I think it's a bag. Okay, just give me a second here. What do you do? I have no scissors. I made a mistake. I should have brought scissors. Oh, I found out. It comes out of this little part of the bag. So here's some jewels that I'm going to put on. They're on. I'm not going to put the eyeball. Okay, there. So the two eyeballs I'll put to the side. So I got my glaze and my blue thingies already on. So I'm just going to put some glaze on top and then sprinkle on these jewels. Move it around and stuff. Okay, so my glaze is on now and I'm going to put on some red hearts or pink hearts. A yellow star. A red circle. A little teensy green circle that I can't even really pick up. And a red heart. So that's kind of cool now. And put those to the side. So this is how my eyeball is doing. The glaze is not all dry yet. But it's almost dry. And I'll make one more. And I have this. But this time we're going to use the book to read it. What to do. So for this one, I'm going to make, I'll make the, okay, why is it, okay, 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 I don't really care, what is this, so, oh, okay, so I guess I'll just make a normal one now, so I'm going to use this cool, tie-dye one over here. It's not really tie-dye, but it's like colorful and I just thought that was cool. So I'm going to put some on the back of my little tie-dye thing and put it onto my bottle cap. And then I'm not going to, I'm going to use some, a charm. I'm going to use this alien over here. It's cute and it matches the green and yellow that's on my thingy my bottle cap. So this is the alien. So now I'm going to put some glue on the back of my alien and stick it on. I'm also going to put glaze on top of this. And I'm going to stick this down and move this glaze around so it can be shiny. And then stick my alien on top. So this is it. So these were the three bottle caps I made. 
I need the Jewel Blue Thunder, that's what I'll call it, the Eyeball Person, and Alien in Tidiness. Okay, well, I made up really weird names, and thanks for watching this video. By the way, my name is Nyla, and I'm Classy Clack. Classy Craft Collector. Be sure to check out my next video, which is coming up in a couple of hours. And just so you know, this is my first video, and it's a new channel that I just made, and I thought it was a good idea to unbox some crafts. Um, you're going to see me in other videos, and for my next video, be sure to watch me painting some plaster horses. Bye!